Iran says nuclear discussions will pick up soon. Iran and the EU confirmed Saturday the restart of indirect discussions between Iran and the US. EU foreign policy chief Josep Borrell said negotiations would restart soon and immediately to address the final outstanding concerns the senior EU diplomat told reporters. Talks between Iran, the US, and the EU won't be in Vienna, because they won't be in the P4 plus 1 framework, referring to Britain, China, France, Russia, and Germany. The discussions will likely take place in a Gulf state. The standoff should be broken in the next days. We must speed up after three months. I'm pleased with Tehran and Washington's choice borrow. Amir Abdullahian said he and Borrell discussed Iran's requests in detail, adding, we're ready to restart conversations in the next days. The Iranian people's economic advantage from the Jpoa is crucial to the Iranian government, and any problem that fails to guarantee Iran's economic interests would not be acceptable, he said. We will strive to fix the challenges and disagreements in the discussions that will start shortly, he added, expressing optimism that the US would take realistic and fair action this time to reach a deal. In a separate meeting with Borrell, Iran's Supreme National Security Council Secretary Ali Shamkhani said Iran wants a solid, stable, and dependable accord in nuclear discussions. Shamkhani remarked, We've never left the table while completing JPOA duties. A deal that doesn't relieve illegal sanctions and ensure Iran's economic interests is useless, he said. Iran signed the JPOA in July 2015, agreeing to limit its nuclear development in exchange for sanctions relief. Former U.S. President Donald Trump withdrew from the deal in May 2018 and reimposed unilateral sanctions on Tehran, causing Iran to downgrade some of its nuclear obligations. Iran and the other JPOA parties have had eight rounds of negotiations in Vienna since April 2021. Since March, when a final deal seemed close, the discussions have been postponed, raising fears about their future.